Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another vlog. I am doing a Coachella pre prep with me kind of weekend or kind of week. Uh, I am going to Coachella this weekend one with a brand. I'm going with Adidas. Kind of a full circle if you guys have been following me, you know, last year I got scammed at Coachella. Like my my wristband was like either like not real or it was like something whatever. It was a whole mess um so we have moved up we are now going to coachella for work and i'm really really excited about it but i'm also nervous because i've never gone to coachella for work i've gone the past six years the past six times um with like friends or family i've camped like it's normally just been for like fun and music so this is going to be a little bit of a different experience but like I said, I am. Just, I just wanted to vlog the little things that I'm gonna be doing. Uh, I'm not really gonna do too much like prep, um, but I do have like a few things that I'm gonna do this week, and I thought I would just vlog it. Um, but like I said, I am going with Adidas, and I actually have to go to the Adidas store right now and make, pick up some selects. Um, I was gonna order online, but everything is sold out, and I have to leave in like three days. So I don't know if it'll. I don't know if it'll even get here on time. So they gave me a gift card and I can go to the, like my nearest Adidas store. So I'm a little bit nervous that they won't have anything. I thought I would still check out the store anyways, but let's go do that. Okay, so I realized that the Adidas store is not in like the part of, I came to the Americana, but the Adidas store is actually at the Galleria. So I have to walk over there, but I stopped at Aritzia, obviously. And I'm just getting some more of the TNA butter workout because it's my favorite now i'm gonna try on some jean shorts because i'm just now realizing all the shorts that i have at home might be too big for me so i'm gonna try on a few different styles and sizes i grabbed these like white they're not even linen i don't know what these are like but pants i feel like they're gonna be see-through though and then i grabbed this like white linen skirt i feel like it could be cute and then i grabbed this dress which i think could be cute but they don't have a size small so I, they brought me the purple one to try on for size. I kind of feel like I'm back in junior high with like the length of these shorts. <laughs> but I have such short legs, the shorts that come like right here look really weird on me. I don't know, I feel like, I feel like the short ones are cute. Okay, I, why do I always record at this creepy angle? I secured the goods. Secured the good at Adidas and I'm gonna pop in a Zara. Okay, so we've moved on now to the Zara fitting room. I actually hate trying things on, but I feel like I have to. I think this is not something you'd expect me to pick. But I feel like with this jean, maybe, and the Adidas that I picked out, it could be kind of cute and chill, because I, I want to be comfortable. I want to be chill this year. Like, I don't really need to be doing the most. I feel like this just would be flattering. Um, and I feel like this actually could be cute to my trip to Mexico City next week. And then I have these really cute shorts at home that I feel like this could be cute with, with, like, maybe, like, a boho belt. Oh, shoot. I don't think these are gonna fit me, but I've always wanted baggy white pants and I feel like it could also be cute with that maybe. I don't know if this is like really giving anything. I feel like it's cuter on the hanger than on me. Not that I have like really big boobs, but I just feel like sometimes they get in the way of like outfits. Like I feel like if someone was like more, I don't know. I like, I like the detail on it, but I feel like it's not giving anything special. Whew, okay, back in the car. Zara was kind of a flop. I'm a little bit out of breath. The elevator was um, closed, so I had to walk up the parking garage, but I'm all about getting my steps in these days, but I'm gonna go across the street. I should've walked it, but I honestly, I feel kind of embarrassed. I just like walking around with like, a bunch of shopping bags and like going to like a little cafe. Whew. I'm gonna go to Joe and the juice and grab some lunch. I also want like a green juice. Also reminding me I need to drink water. I brought my Stanley with me. Something about today, I feel really bloated and it's honestly kind of, it's like the worst day because I was trying on a bunch of clothes and everything just looked really bad on me so I didn't get anything at Zara. But 
I could just feel it in my stomach like it just does not feel good I'm assuming it's I'm assuming it's from like all the drinking I did over the weekend so right now I'm just trying to drink a bunch of water I have an infrared hot yoga sculpt class later so that'll be good to kind of sweat everything out um, but yeah I just feel I have a lot of toxins in my body so I need to do some detoxing okay secured the late lunch early dinner bag I got a green juice did I say I went to Joe in the juice I stopped at Joe in the juice and then I got a tuna cotto no I got a spicy tuna sandwich and then added avocado I haven't had that in a minute because ever since it became really popular on TikTok, it's always sold out. Honestly, pretty good. Here we go. Mmm. Mmm. There's something about the crunch of this bread is insane. Okay. I'm gonna eat my sandwich in the car, drive home. And then, or I have hot yoga at 7.30. Okay. Ah! I just get creeped out when I see myself in a sports bra and leggings, but I am home now. I just changed, but I want to tell you guys that the, I want to tell you guys that the, literally, why can't I talk? I wanted to tell you guys, I am, I'm really bloated right now and I'm really insecure about it, so don't look at me too, don't look at me too harshly, but um, the set that I got from Aritzia, the TNA Butter, sports bra and leggings literally my favorites i'm so glad i got another pair because my other ones are in the wash but um it's just so comfortable they look weird they're so comfortable they're so soft and i just like i just like the way they fit oh don't look at me i'm disgusting right now i'm going to They gave me this cute little white workout set. Three. Really good. You have two. Let's go last one. From here, what I want you to do is walk into your glutes. Four. Three. It's going to get a little slight. So go ahead and open that. It's got a really special um, application. You'll see it looks kind of like a bamboo shoot. But go ahead and put three, four, five drops, whatever, whatever feels good. And you're going to just pack this into your skin so, so gently. Reminding yourself, you can always start on it. Beautiful. Hi guys, a little bit, oh my hair. I re-got ready and changed because I am going to meet Negan from Gizu. I don't know if I've ever talked about this before, but my friends definitely know I was like obsessed with Negan. I used to like love her YouTube channel. I mean, I still love her. I support anything Gizu. And and the team, Team Gizu invited me and Alyssa to their pop-up here at the Grove in LA. And I think Negan's gonna be there. It said like meet co-founder. But like, I don't know, like maybe she like only came for a little bit and like she won't be there by the time I get there, but about to head out, but I just got changed for the day and I thought I'd show you guys my outfit. I um, didn't style my hair last night after I washed it. This is pretty much my natural hair, but I curled the front two pieces because those always get a little bit weird. But I left, we're doing natural hair, my Lula. We're doing natural hair today and I don't know how to feel about it. I'm wearing this dress from Realization Par. I love Realization Par dresses. I feel like I can dress them up and down really easily, which I re-wear a lot of my outfits because I got to get my money's use out of these dresses. And then I'm wearing the new um, Adidas that I got yesterday. They're like these platform gazelles. Or no, yeah. My bag is from By Far, which I got last summer, and then I just have this little like ribbon attached to it. Yeah, let's go. <laughs> Thank you. 
Hi you guys, it is the next day of the, sorry I, I'm driving right now. I feel like I didn't end yesterday's part of the vlog after we went to the Grove to the Gizu pop-up which was so freaking cute. Look at my little Gizu lip oil. Little customized Gizu lip oils. But I am on my way back home to pick up Alyssa. I just had my lymphatic. I just had my lymphatic massage appointment. I've been going weekly um, for like about a month now. They really fuck this stupid ass bus. It's my way. They really help me, especially because I will like go out during the weekends. I try my best to like not, you know, like have, you know, too many drinks because I'm like working really hard to like live, you know, I'm working really hard to be like healthy and like clean eating and making sure. Oh, there's so much traffic right now. I'm a little bit confused. Um, but yeah, I'm headed home now. I'm gonna pick up Alyssa, or I'm gonna yeah, go home. I wanna make like a little lunch protein smoothie. I'm getting a little bit hungry again. And then pick up Alyssa, she's gonna come with me. I have a second fitting for Ablen Studios. I am already working on like the next drop, even though the first drop hasn't happened. Um, but I actually really wish that this item could be in the first shop, but my production team is telling me that it's kind of unlikely considering that the, I'm barely getting the sample of this one and my other ones are already done. So that's fine, but I'm bringing Alyssa with me because she was my fit model for my last items and they were like, can you bring the same girl? And I was like, yeah, that's my sister. So I'm bringing Alyssa so she can be the fit model. And then after I signed up for my heated room workout class today, but apparently there's a wait list, so I may not even be able to take my workout class tonight. Hello, I'm like literally going down. We haven't done a carpool karaoke in a minute. Liars are calling me one. Nobody's heard from me for months. I'm doing better than I ever was. Alyssa's here now. We just got out of my Ablen Studios fitting. Told you guys Alyssa was gonna be the fit model. I always try things on too because I, I want to try it on, but it's always meant for Alyssa's sizing. Well, she's like a uh, standard, like you, whoops. The sample sizes are a standard US small and that's Alyssa's size. Like I'm kind of in between a medium sometimes. So I try it on for vibes, but I'm not really <laughs> the fit model. Um, Everything but fits you too though. It fits me too, but I always like, I feel like I rather just get a medium because my chest area, I feel like is not a small. Yeah, I wasn't blessed there. So I always just get mediums. Anyways, not the point. Um, now meeting's over. We're gonna head to the Melrose area because we were supposed to go yesterday, but all the stores closed at six yesterday, so we didn't make it. It's very random. I wanna go to the Adidas store to pick up a third pair of shoes, possibly you guys saw I went to the Adidas store on Monday. Um, and if not, maybe like something cool that I could use the style. Is this a weekly vlog? Yeah, but I'm gonna stop it tomorrow because I'm doing like Coachella week mm. prep. Mm -hmm. um, and then I ran into my friend Julia yesterday, Alyssa got to meet her, and she had the coolest pair of jeans on, like baggy vintage Levi's, and I'm gonna go check out that store too because I missed it yesterday because it closed at six. Is it on Melrose too? Yeah, I think so, but there's so much traffic today. I know, so many. Like everywhere. Um, but that's my update, and I'll see you guys on Melrose. I don't even know what I'll do. Obviously, 
later in the day i have been home for a minute me and also got lunch like you saw and then i came home and i had to edit some videos for why to whip my head like that i had to edit some videos for um a brand deal and i had to submit those so i was just doing a little bit of work and then got a little bit lazy or did some laundry i don't know i've just been like it's been mellow whatever i thought we would go through my coachella outfits right now or the lack thereof so let me grab my stuff of what i'm thinking about oh i also we also popped into this store in obviously in la oh actually you saw where was oh you saw us at the adidas store after the Adidas store, I popped into this other store. It's called Shop RLT. It's on Beverly. Yeah, it's, it's on Beverly in West Hollywood because my friend Julia that I saw yesterday, I was like, oh, your jeans are so cute. And she's like, oh my God, I literally just got them from the store. And by the time I wanted to go to the store, it was closed. So I went today and I found a really cute pair of jeans because I feel like I'm really in between right now where I have jeans that are baggy that just don't even fit me like it's not even like a baggy feel like they just don't fit me or i have like my really tailored jeans so i'm like i want like a just like a nice baggy jean but it doesn't look like i'm drowning in it you know just like the perfect baggy jean and i prefer levi's so that's what they were and then there was like this perfect white tank it was 40 dollars, but it was so perfect that i had to get it so let's go through this First, I think you guys saw me try them on, but I got a third pair of Adidas, which is good because Coachella is three days and I only had two pair of shoes. Let's do a thumbnail. Um, how cute! Oh my god, these have pink laces and they gave me white laces too, but I feel like I think I like the pink. So I got these. I have no idea how I'm going to style them, but I'm sure we can make it work. And these are the Levi's I got. They are 505s, which are a baggier fit. My Levi's that I wear now are 501. So they're a lot more tailored, straight fit, as opposed to these are more of like a wide baggy leg. Still straight though. And then I got them in a size 34. And I typically wear a size 32. Yeah, 32, 31, depending on that. And then obviously just a white tank. <laughs> but it's so good, you guys. It's so good. I think I'm gonna wear my jeans, this white tank, and my sneakers tomorrow. Like, that's what I'm gonna wear to show up. Okay, let's get down to the nitty freaking gritty. Oh, also, my same friend Julia um, lent me this belt because I was showing her some inspiration of the outfits that I want, and the key components of the outfits were a belt, and I didn't have one. And she was like, oh my god, I have one just like that. You can borrow it. And I was like, thank you so when i went to go pick it up when i went to go pick up the belt from her she was like i have this and i was like oh, wait a minute that's so freaking cute it's a size two though and i feel like i'm more of like a size four but it looks a little bit stretchy so i'll try it on right now but look how cute it is it has like roses on it maybe even with the white tank that could be cute i don't know so i'm thinking this i'm gonna do a try on right now too i'm thinking this with the belt so that's like one option and with the tank and then probably the black adidas sneakers that i got and then next i went to a gifting and they had the skirt there it's by the brand addicted which i've seen on instagram before but i got a few things from this brand i don't know if this is gonna fit me either i don't know i have body dysmorphia like i feel like sometimes i look at things and i'm like that's too small i can't even but i was just like fuck it and i couldn't try on so i was like fuck it i'll just get it I don't know what i really wish i had like a flowy like crochet top so i don't know what to wear with this either so that's another missing another half ass outfit that i don't have um but i also could scrap that denim skirt for the crochet skirt that julia gave me if it doesn't fit me and then this was my favorite thing that i ordered the only thing i ordered in advance it's this brown long sleeve off the shoulder dress from frankie's bikinis i've actually never ordered any of their clothes so I really like this and I also think, well, I don't know if the vibes will match. I think so. I think with this belt could be really cute and then like my hair like maybe kind of messy. 
with the yellow Adidas sneakers. I wish I could wear, obviously I'm going with Adidas, so I can't not wear Adidas, but I feel like that would be so cute with like black rider boots. Not like horseback rider, like motorcycle rider. I don't know if you guys know what I'm talking about. I feel like that could be really, really cool. And then this is the only outfit, again, haven't tried it on, but I feel like this is the only solid outfit that I have. I got this set. I was blessed to be sent it by one of my favorite like smaller brands. It's called Campbell and Kramer. I've posted them before. Um, they're really, really dope. So I got this skirt, right? With the matching bandeau with my pink Adidas, right? But, oh, I wish I had a belt for this. And I think like I can't wear the belt three days in a row. I wish that one, I wish I had like a brown belt, you know what I mean? Or something like suede, like something with like a different texture would be really cool. Or like something more like a, a western -y buckly belt. I have a brown belt, but it's more like simple, classic, chic. You wear it with jeans and a white tank vibe. So I don't know if that belt will work. Actually, I have a chain belt. It's silver. Wait, I bought earrings yesterday. Where the hell are they? Hee <laughs> hee. Right here. Okay, so I got these earrings from Zara. Honestly, I don't have luck with finding things at Zara. I feel like I don't really shop there anymore because I never find anything. But I did find these earrings. They're like mixed metal. It's like silver and gold. So now that I'm thinking, because I normally wear my Ava necklace, which is gold. And if I wear these earrings that has mixed metal and then I wear my silver belt, that could work. Okay, option one, I'm already not loving it. And you know what's so annoying is that I feel like I work really, really hard to like eat as healthy as possible and to work out. But then just sometimes when I put on clothes, it makes me not feel that confident. But I'm also working so hard to be like, it doesn't matter what you look like, wear what you want, because that's always been like, I've always been like that. Like, I feel like I never used to think like, oh, I can't wear that because like, whatever. But ever since like, I've gotten to like this mindset where I'm like trying to, you know, like get in shape. Like it's not triggering. I don't know. I'm not trying to like dump on you guys, but I feel like when you kind of start to like really put in work and like, you're like not seeing the results right away. Like it is a little bit disheartening, but I need to be like, whatever. Like, you look good. Like, you would have worn this if you were, like, 15 pounds heavier and not even cared. So, I feel like I need to, like, relax. Like, it's not about... It's not about my body. It's about the clothes and feeling good and, you know? But, <laughs> going back to my original thought, is I feel like... I don't know if I'm... I don't know if I'm doing this outfit justice. I don't hate the belt. I don't know if you guys can see, I have the pink Adidas on with it. I feel like this could be cute. I also have this cowboy hat, but like, is that a little weird? I feel like it's just a little simple, but you know, I'm a simple gal. Okay, next outfit. Okay, this outfit I feel like makes the least amount of sense and this was the outfit I was initially the most excited for. It's honestly kind of hurting. Not good. You want to be comfortable at Coachella? So, I, like I was saying, I got this dress from Frankie's. I had this whole like vision in mind, like cool girl belt, cowboy boots, rider boots, probably wear like a pendant necklace or something like that. Um, this is the belt that my friend Julia gave me. I don't know if it looks weird with it because this is tie-dye and this is kind of like a shell but also i'm wearing it with the yellow adidas oh shit sorry my camera cut off but like i was saying i don't know if this looks weird but the kind of color of the shells i feel like matches the yellow adidas but i also think it makes zero sense and this is what i was looking forward to most like, like when am i gonna wear this dress again Actually, I'm like an outfit repeater, I'm a rewearer, so like I'll find a different reason for it, but I feel like it was, it's time to shine, was that Coachella? <sighs> and I feel so, I literally had a lymphatic massage today, so I wouldn't feel bloated, and I feel freaking bloated. <sighs> okay, this low-key might be my favorite one. So I'm wearing the white tank that I got, and sorry, I'm not wearing a bra. Okay, anyways, and the skirt that Julia let me, with the belt that Julia let me, with... The black sneakers like i feel like this is 
kind of like the vibe that I was going for for like all the outfits like I'm just comfortable and I'm gonna dance and I'm gonna wear my Adidas but I'm not like doing the most but I'm also not like trying so hard but I look bad like I feel like this is like me like this is what I wanted to wear for all my outfits but it wasn't coming together so we only have one good outfit perfect I feel like if I did my hair like kind of like messy with like some like braids in it like and then I just did like a really simple everyday makeup like bronzy like I feel like this is like this is my vibe so we have one outfit but actually Bella Venice I DM them asked if they did like pickups because there's this one set that I'm like obsessed with but obviously if I would have known that I hated all my outfits I would have ordered it but they said that I could possibly go and pick it up because they're located here in LA so like freaking god for them if that um comes through so i can just scratch one of these horrendous outfits my room is a disaster and then i'm oh, fucked i'm suddenly getting really tired it's gonna be midnight so i'm gonna pack like lightly pack and then take a shower take a shower and go to bed i have a workout tomorrow morning so tomorrow i'll do some work work out pack pick up my shit and hopefully and then head to the airport tomorrow so i'll see you tomorrow i'm going to end off the coachella prep vlog here i am just about to head out to the airport i'm wearing just i'm wearing just this black tank from aritzia i think my crew neck, because it's low-key cold and raining all of a sudden, is from Anine Bing. And then these are the vintage Levi's that I showed you guys yesterday with my new Adidas. We are packed. That's not it, but this is it. We are packed and ready to go. Hopefully, I don't come back with anything else because I literally do not have room for it. But let's go to Coachella.